What in car nation? Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Josh Watson. <laughs> we're farming today, boys. All right, guys, so we're out here with my buddy Josh Watson with Watson Farms with the cab over, and as you can see, some pretty serious grain silos. Um, he does corn and soybeans, and we're waiting on a call back from a couple different places whether we're going to haul a load of corn or a load of soybeans today. Um, he has his Peterbilt he usually uses, but we're going to hook up to his trailer. And once we know what we're going to be hauling today, we're going to be hooking up the trailer and getting it loaded up. First, we may do a little uh, tour around the farm here and see what all he's got going on uh, while waiting on that phone call. All right, guys, here's Josh. <laughs> so what are we waiting on right now? Uh, we're going to get some soybeans out of this harvest store silo, get Bruce loaded up. Uh, he's going to run up the green back for me, save me a little time on hauling these soybeans. Right? Yeah, I want to experience driving a bean, bean trailer today. Is that what you guys call it? Yeah, hopper things? bottom. Hopper bottom. Hopper there we go. Bottom. I'm going to learn all about it. So uh, we're gonna get hooked up the trailer and uh, get it pulled over here underneath the silo, what we call it, the silos. That's the name for them. All right, and uh, get it loaded up. Guys, so we're all backed up to the silos now. He's turning on the conveyor belts, and what they're gonna do is start moving some soybeans in here. Yeah, <laughs> oh my goodness! There it goes. Slowly. What this thing does. It lets them out of these silos, down to these conveyor belts. These conveyor belts move it on up these paths here, over to those pipes over there, and then down over to here. Start weighing her down. Real hard to see, guys. It's super dusty. It's filling up. So normally, it's what now? It normally, ain't that dusty. Two year old beans. beautiful here in Tennessee. I don't know, last time I've been there, it was All right, guys, we got this thing full. We're putting the cover on it now. Tighten it down. You ready to go? Ready to rock. All right, guys, we're loaded up and headed out to the Farmer's Market Co-op. Can't film too much while we're driving, but I'll get some clips while we're stopped. All right, here you go, guys.
up here, guys, to the co-op. Old freight liner didn't do too bad. We'll walk inside the office here. All right, so it looks like we gotta pull around back behind this place. Wish I had someone getting footage from the outside for you guys, but we're working on that. Amber's still sleeping. It's a little early for her. Truck ran great. Didn't get on it real hard, guys. Never got over. Never really got even anywhere near 200 degrees. Just got someone else up here ahead of us. So what they're going to do is we're going to pull in here, uncover it, and then they'll do an inspection. Pull in here and see if we can rock these scales at. Should be interesting. Ooh, baby. 48, the trailer ain't even on it yet. Dang, Josh. Right on the money. So what he's doing now, guys, he's sticking that thing in there and he's going to uh, pull a sample from the bottom of the hopper and go in his office and check it and make sure they're viable for what these guys are buying right now. Guys, I'm learning all of this as I'm doing this. Don't make fun of me, don't roast me too bad, but we've got the bottom of the hopper right here open. We're draining all the uh, soybeans down into the auger down here. They're gonna pump it up in there to the silos and uh, turn it into calcium, I guess. So we're gonna be here for a minute. Turn this big lever right here and it drains down into there. Well, you see all the, all the uh, soybeans are funneling right down in there, guys, so that, come on now, get the camera to adjust, sorry. Bomb this hopper. Going up there and getting sorted and doing whatever they're gonna do with it. Maybe I'll ask the guy about that. There you have it, guys, 28,720 is our uh, empty weight truck and trailer. Here we go, 60,000 pounds of soybeans. We get the top put back on and roll on them. Let's so get rid of the horn. Got her. <laughs> Got him. Why you gotta do that? How you doing? You got beauty sleep or no? Not really. Uh, oh God, put your sunglasses back on. We're up here at Josh's shop, Diesel Den Performance. We're gonna walk in here and check some stuff. Oh, look at that Peterbilt there. So Josh has got this Peterbilt sitting in the shop. That's got this much dust on it. And I don't think he needs it, but he don't want to sell it. He's got a sleeper out back for it and everything. He's got a pulling truck up there. And the way I know Josh, guys, we used to sled pull back in the day together. And I'd show up and make a pass. He'd show up and blow a truck up. So now he keeps trucks on the ceiling. It's the best place for a pull truck right up there and builds a ton of manual transmissions. All right, guys, so Amber and I found a little river. Oh, it's making me a date. Ooh, dick. And uh, we're just chilling. Get her. We're at right, the Bald River. We were gonna go up to the falls, but it's like 30 minutes and nine miles. And I don't think I wanna take the semi all the way up there. So when we come back next week with my pickup on the semi trailer and all that, then maybe we'll, uh, do some more exploring, what do you say? I think it's a good idea. Oh my gosh, everybody, Amber caught a fish. He says I wasn't gonna catch one, I did it my first try. Oh, that was pretty good, that was a good one. How do you learn how to do that? What? How do you learn how to do that? What do you mean how to learn? We gotta go soon, I gotta go pee. Huh, nice. He reminds me of the Grinch when he stands like that.
his peeing stance. I have to go pee so bad, but he wants to go first. Mm -hmm. Back on the road we go, down the mountain. Look, we got the rocks. Oh goodness. You gonna get out? Look guys, we're out here headed home through the mountains actually, as you guys noticed. And there's this old Tennessee Valley train. We're gonna go explore, see if it's unlocked. 